down to Dennis House, who is at Foxwoods for the Republican convention. Dennis. Jody, good evening to you. We are here inside the ballroom at the Fox Tower at the Foxwoods Resort Casino here in Mashantucket, where right now the Republican convention is just getting underway. It started about a half an hour ago with a prayer. Pledge of Allegiance and the National Anthem. Right now they're going through some rules and they're talking about what will be happening. Now the big event tonight is the nomination of Bob Stefanowski. He will be the endorsed candidate leaving this convention. There's no doubt about it. There's only one other Republican running for governor, Susan Patricelli Reagan. By all accounts, she's expected to get about 30 delegates. That's what I'm being told and not enough to qualify for a primary need. 15%, there are just over 900 delegates here. So, Mr. Stefanowski, after that happens, we'll be addressing the crowd here tonight. The roll call begins at about 6.30. Behind me, you can see, now, it goes in alphabetical order. So, Andover is right in the front row, and Woodbury is in the last row here. And delegates are starting to come in. That roll call for governor will begin at about 6.30. Should be done by about 8 o'clock, and then Stefanowski is expected to address the audience here then the nomination of his running mate, Laura Devlin, will take place. And tomorrow, though, is expected to be the big show with perhaps some fireworks. It's the race to see who will run against Senator Richard Blumenthal. There are three big names running for Senate. That is Claritas, the former House Minority Leader, Leora Levy, a Republican Party executive, and Peter Lumage, who ran for Secretary of the State before and ran for governor before, lost both races. So. Claritas seems to be the heavy favorite here tonight, according to some of the people that I've been talking to. And they also, many of the people here do not want a primary. So if the other two candidates qualify for a primary, there may be some pressure put on them to get behind the endorsed candidate here. But of course, we'll have much more coming up on News 8 at 6 o'clock. But for now, I'm live here in Mashantucket. And, and Darren, back to you.